Hey everybody, I actually uh, just wanted to go through one of my actual favorite tools real fast. Uh, go through the rest of the stuff I use from other screwdrivers, bits, pry tools, soldering iron, SDM stations, that. But one of the more of my favorite tools are, and because it works with a lot of the other screwdriver bits and everything, is actually this electric screwdriver. It's got a couple of LED lights in the end about three of them still kind of fairly bright there are a ton of these out there this one's actually made by uh, wow stick if my camera would focus that'd be great and it's not going to but just charges through micro USB port on the back side um, works great doesn't have a whole lot of torque so sometimes if you have really stubborn screws you have to manually kind of loosen them at first and then use the reverse button to back them out. Uh, it's the other good thing about this. I've had another one of these that pretty much once the battery dies you don't have the ability to turn by hand. It'll actually just free spin. That was one thing I did like about this one. Also too when you're tightening, like I said, the torque's not real high so less likely you're going to strip the screws out when you're using them to put them back in. You can kind of get them down to where what we consider finger tight and then still just kind of manually go through at the end. Um, I don't remember how much I paid for this. It's been a while. I've been using it for about two years now. Like I said, there's a ton of other brands. This one's been great. It uh, comes with a lot of bits for it. And I do mean a lot. There's three different sets of bits. And you have everything from Phillips down to uh, quadruple zero up to Phillips two, H bits, flatheads, you got hex. Um, there's a couple of the um, torque security bits in here. There's a few of the Y um, ends that are really popular. I know on no, they are on iPhones, and I think the Nintendo Wii's for sure have a couple of them in there. I had to take a few of those apart the couple of days ago. It's got the square bit ends on them. Like I said, it's just, and they're super, they're actually super nice on there. Sorry about my camera not focusing correctly, but, I mean, it's a good set. I mean, for what you get, there's some these ones have. I can get the thing open. And they slide out. They're all just on the one thing, but this one just happens to have the extended ones down on the end, so a couple of them that are a little deeper that the end of the screwdriver won't fit into. But like I said, they're all really nice. I've been using them for about a year and a half. Really, the only ones I've had to replace were pretty much the Phillips bits that I just kind of went out, bought another set of those online, just kind of threw them in there. And, uh, yeah, but I tear up Phillips bits constantly just because they're the most common screws on everything. Like I said, it's a good little screwdriver. I mean, it saves your hand, and that's about all more I got to say on it. All right, well, thank you for watching. Like if you want to, leave a comment below, and subscribe if you want to see more.